Hello everyone, welcome once again to Investing with the Difference. So if you are a busy person and who is not tracking a lot of things, so this video is for you to help uh, some of the action items uh, if you are using your minute and if you want to interact and do some important things. First of all, there has been a fake ECAF account uh, created uh, which is called ECAF official with an E instead of A and uh, they have been sending some transactions to your account uh, which is uh, inviting you to click on a link and some other things uh, which are definitely a scam so do not engage with any of those messages or any links provided in that uh, the second part is um, anyway I think uh, you need to understand that you need to keep your keys secure always never enter or log into any site uh, without knowing what you're doing uh, this, the other item is um, I'm very excited with Scatter 10. Uh, by the way, if you have not downloaded Scatter 10, if you are on Scatter version 9 or before, uh, you will have to download. It cannot be updated directly from 9.0 version because of some uh, issues I think they had. Also, remember when you go to Scatter 10, uh, only download version 10.0.2. Uh, the reason I'm recommending this is because they have a lot of great improvements, uh, especially around uh, how to set up accounts. Uh, how, the, everything in the interface has changed. It's much more uh, readable, understandable. There are a lot of description around every part of the wallet. And uh, it is also supports Telos, which is again great thing. You can import, you can add networks like Telos. You can support uh, uh, your EOS accounts and you can also do operations like changing keys and so on so it's becoming a full-fledged wallet uh, more importantly it's becoming very easy to use uh, again if you are first time into scatter you should start with this it will not be as easy as uh, for people who are already using scatter but i think it's uh, way better than what it was earlier uh, but again remind uh, let me remind you you have to use 10.0.2 do not try to download which is something which is earlier because uh, first uh, scatter 10 was released there was a couple of bugs and that's why you always have to wait for a couple of days um, for the feedback for any new wallet uh, so i am hearing that squirrel wallet for telos is also working fine but again don't be in a hurry for telos as i said before uh, that is let the tool settle down i'm very comfortable with scatter because uh, i already tested this and uh, it's working well for telos as well as uh, uh, other uh, uh, eos mainnet now one more reason why scatter is important i think we keep talking about it you need to use uh, any dApps, anything uh, more importantly you can nowadays like if you look at there's a new explorer eos x and now eos x is from eos go uh, and uh, from eos asia which has previously developed uh, toolkits and so on some uh, great stuff uh, what they have is a uh, explorer which can be used for EOS mainnet, for Telos, for any of the sister chains they're going to support. And they also support a lot of function. They have integrated the My EOS Toolkit functions into it. So you can, if you have Scatter, you can log into this, you can do any of those operations. Similarly, we talked earlier about EOS DAC. We do recommend you to go and uh, uh, vote for custodians for EOS DAC. Again, for this, you will need Scatter. So this is another action item you need to take. Uh, and similarly blocks.io I think this is another fam favorite um, um, block explorer from, uh, which I like uh, EOS X and uh, blocks.io I think these are a couple of the best block explorers you need to also see that it's continuously getting upgraded blocks.io is also has wallet and uh, voting and everything there are a lot of uh, options which are now integrated into these uh, web pages itself so you don't, uh, if you are com becoming comfortable with Scatter, it will allow you to use all this uh, functionality. Finally, let me remind you to vote. If you are proxying with us, uh, as many of you are, we have 1,666 accounts. We do recommend you to go and uh, update uh, your proxy because uh, as you can see, we have uh, some big amount of DK. Uh, in total, we have 5.3% of vote DK. So we do need you to go and update uh, your proxy. Similarly, we do have uh, same account name investing WAD for Telos. So if you have already enabled your account, you can proxy your accounts uh, to us if you need uh, or you can vote directly. As I said, uh, if you are not comfortable with wallets and if you are comfortable with Scatter, I would say that you can use EOS X uh, Explorer and uh, you can make those transactions directly from the wallet like uh, vote uh, transfer tokens and so on so this is what i like about this i think uh, uh, they had earlier created my eos toolkit 
uh, and uh, now they have integrated this into a pretty good uh, explorer which can show you all the transactions as well so this is a quick summary of why I think uh, a quick action item for you uh, do download scatter 10.0.2 and make sure that you are participating in the chain uh, voting in your stack uh, and uh, you are if you want to claim telos or you want to do any other operations on any of the chains on eos thank you once again for joining and uh, have a great uh, holiday week